So this is one of the realest conversations I've ever had with you. And for me to be really up close and personal, I gotta get inside your head. Because I know what you're thinking. I know about all the fears. I know about all the negative self-talk, the negative self-thoughts. Listen to me. The number of years you spend in a relationship never makes it okay for you to feel more pain, for you to deal with more hurt, for you to deal with more lies, more betrayal. The facts are this. That person that you're with now is not the same person you met when you first started dating. So I know it's uncomfortable, but I need you to ask yourself a serious question. If you were single and you met the person that you're with now, would you enter into a relationship with that person? Let me answer that for you. No. You would run. You wouldn't give that person the time of day. So it's okay if you leave now. It's okay for you to move on. Permission granted. I know, that's your baby. That's your boo. That's your baby. But that's not the same person that you met. Let me say it like this. The caterpillar. Caterpillar transforms into a beautiful butterfly. There was a point in time where you had a beautiful butterfly in your life. But the problem is, your beautiful butterfly transformed and regressed back to a caterpillar. The problem is, you would never have dated a caterpillar. The caterpillar is not your type. It's just like the frog prince. Yeah, your frog turned into a prince to a princess. But unfortunately, regressed back to a toad. Not, not worse than a toad. Your prince, your princess turned into a tadpole. So right now, you're in love with a tadpole. But you know it's not right. They're betraying your trust. They're cheating on you. They're lying to you. They're making you feel less than. They're talking crazy to you. They're doing things now that they never did back then. It's okay for you to move on. It's okay for you to leave. Can I get super real with you right now? Everybody sees it, except you. Right now, you're the one that's blinded to the fact that you're dating a tadpole. You never would have dated somebody like this in the past. So I need you to exercise your move on muscle, put together you an exit strategy, and find a way to get yourself out of this bad relationship. No more excuses. You deserve better, and better is out there waiting for you. So stop devaluing yourself. Oh, I can hear you now. Oh, I don't know what I'm gonna do without this person. You're gonna do just great. Three things happen when a relationship ends. You either get worse, you either stay the same, or you get better. And you can do bad by yourself so we know you're not gonna get worse. So again, permission granted for you to move on. And once you exercise that move on muscle and you get past all the pain and all the hurt and you overcome that fear, you will find yourself climbing the hump of a bad relationship and making each and every day of your life a Wednesday. This is a great day to win. Let's go.